Welcome to Mim Learnivate. In today's video, I am gonna tell you about how to check the missing data or missing values in the SPSS. In previous video I have tell you about basics of data entry in SPSS. So, let's get started. So, here I have entered the responses from respondents. I have taken 100 responses. It's all in numeric form, because as I have told you earlier, that SPSS deals with numeric data. You can click here to see the labels that I have assigned to values. Here numeric data changes to string and vice versa. Change to values again. Now, here you can see this dot which represents missing data. Missing data or missing value occur when no data is stored for the variable. It means the respondents didn't answer the question. Missing data have a significant effect on conclusions that can be drawn from the data. So, what is the procedure of checking missing values in your dataset? Go to the Analyze, then go to the Descriptive Statistics, then go the Frequencies. Now you have to select all the dataset to check whether there are any missing values in the dataset. Just select all the variables and move variables into the variable set. Now click OK. After that, the output window pops up in which you can see the output for your tests. Here. You can see the names of each variable in the dataset, and for every variable there are two options, one is valid option, and the other one is missing option. Missing indicates how many missing values are there in the dataset. If you see an organization name, the sample size is 100 which means total responses are 100, and zero indicates that there is no missing value in organization name. Similarly, in second item you can see no missing value. Similarly, in education out of 100 there is one missing frequency means 99 responses are valid, and one is missing. Moving on to fourth item you can see three missing values, and 97 valid responses in the dataset. Moving on the whole dataset you can see the missing values that each variable has. This table shows the number of missing values in each variable which the respondents didn't answer. Hope this video has given you the clear overview on what is missing data and how to check missing values in the dataset. Stay tuned for more videos on SPSS.